Hurricane George knocked on the door in Marathon and then kicked it in like a bad house guest. George stayed too long, made a massive mess, and cost the host a fortune. Total disaster. When we, we came outside during the hurricane and we saw everything blowing away. We saw the roof blowing away over here, the sign, and we stayed around and we watched it. And I was scared. Damage is widespread. His fierce winds ripped through this tiny key and devastated everything. A storm surge washing ashore bashed the coast and turned tranquil waters into raging seas. An ice storage unit becoming a flotation device. Boats rock, lights come crashing down, and roads are impassable. What we need is a bulldozer. Uh, it's just, it's a mess. Just everything here. Uh, it's just going to be almost impossible to clean this thing up. This is just a little family motel, and uh, yeah, we've got like five foot of wires in the rooms. Everything's destroyed. Winds howl like demons, whipping palms, ripping many from the earth. Residents watched as George terrorized their property, but most are happy they stayed to face him and all his fury. Everything's cool. So we, you know, we battened up and. And even though they said, hey, you know, get out, get out, get out, but we're, we're not doing it. You know, this is like, this is our home, we're staying here. This was a very dangerous aspect of the hurricane. Coconuts that were ripped off of palm trees, these went hurling through the air, and if they would have hit you, you would have been in some big trouble. Look at this junk laying all over the place, two by fours. Check it out over here, just garbage, personal belongings, everything laying in the street. This is the back end of the hotel, check this out blew the awning right off, ripped it right off, all the way down the side of the building. This is typical of the type of damage here on Marathon, down trees all over the place, and here's some of the damage with homes. You can see the screen has been completely blown out here, but fortunately, there was a storm shutter in there. You can see boat owners are assessing the damage at this marina, and there is plenty of it. Take a look, this is part of their dock. It is now sitting on the seawall. Get this, a 4,000 pound storage unit for ice. This was actually floating in the storm surge, and this is where George left it. Come on down this way, I'm gonna show you this mess. These tiki huts used to be standing upright. Well, now they are all laying on the ground, and if you look around the corner, that is where the junk has been deposited by Hurricane George after the storm surge left it there.